Hey guys, I'm Jace. Welcome back to Farmstead Forge. Those of you that have been following me along the summer know that we're out of power, so I'm once again working in the barn on a very simple project. Today we are working on building a old school rug beater, just like your great grandpa used, or grandma. If you have a farmstead with critters and kids, a lot of stuff gets tracked into your throw rug, so this would be pretty handy. I'm just starting with a chunk of six inch long, it's quarter inch rod, and we're gonna make it very simple. We'll probably do a little bit of heating on it so we can get our twists right. My initial bend, I'm just gonna do cold, right in the center. Flip it over so I get them very close. And I can adjust this a little bit in the forge, heat it up and get it right. about a foot up from my handle. We're just kind of winging it today. I might have to cut a little excess off. And I'm just gonna make a little mark on here so I can see that when I come out of the fire.
right, so we'll try this out. So obviously it's the cowhide rug. You can't vacuum very good. Yeah, I need to be downwind of that thing. Whew. Sorry for our Montana wind, but if we waited to do this video until the wind was done, we'd probably be here until next year. All right, so this is an outdoor rug that's really hard to vacuum. It's got big high humps in it. Holds up really nice, it's really strong. No children were harmed in the making of this YouTube video. Just rugs. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of this basic rug beater. These are handy to have around, be a handy gift. Maybe that mother-in-law that don't like it, don't give it to her. But even just a nice wall hanger. Um, I wish I had left me some extra length um, for a guy who wraps horse's feet and steel every day, you would think I would know that, but sometimes you're just not used to math other than everyday life. Um, it turned out really nice, it's really sturdy. As you can see, it works really well. Um, like I said, I just have to watch it that my wife doesn't use it on me. This was my first attempt, and it is ugly, ugly, ugly. What I should have done was did my twist down lower and I accidentally put it in the vise and twisted higher than I want to. Um, it would still be usable, but it looks horrible. So this will probably be the everyday user and this one will hang on the wall. So if you did like the video, give it a like, hit subscribe. It's a simple project that you can do in the summer heat and not have a lot of forage time into it. So we'll catch you in the next one.